technique for an intra-articular um, knee injection and we're going to be doing a visco supplement injection. Um, main indication today for the procedure is osteoarthritis and the main goal of the injection is pain relief. The risks and benefits of the procedure have been reviewed with the patient and the appropriate consents have been signed. We're going to be demonstrating a lateral infrapatellar approach with the patient in a seated position and the knee flexed to 90 degrees. At this point we'll identify the important landmarks for the injection and mark the injection site. So our landmarks will be the patellar tendon and the tibial plateau and our injection site will be approximately one centimeter lateral to the patellar tendon and one centimeter superior to the tibial plateau. There's usually a soft indentation at that site which is where we'll mark for the injection. At this point with the skin marked we'll prep the skin and we typically will use betadine and or alcohol to clean the skin. The medications that we're going to be using today will be again a visco supplement and the medicine we use in our clinic is Uflexa and it's a two milliliter syringe and we use a 22 gauge one and a half inch needle for the injection. So with the skin prepped we'll now use a topical anesthetic which is ethyl chloride spray spray for approximately five seconds about six inches away from the skin. This helps with the initial needle stick um, and for comfort to the patient. So again with the injection site marked we keep the needle perpendicular to that and advance the needle and inject the medication. If you encounter resistance with advancement of the needle or injection of the medication, we we'll just reposition slightly until the needle or medication moves smoothly. We apply a little pressure after the medicine is injected and we'll clean off the excess betadine and apply a band-aid. The patient is also given post-injection uh, care instructions and we will see him in one week for um, third injection of visco supplementation.